Hi everyone, I hope you're having a good day. My name is Ethan Reeve and I'm 21 years old and from Blackpool and I was 18 when I started my fitting apprenticeship with BAE Systems. When I was 16 I left high school and I did okay with my GCSEs, not the best and not the worst. Uh, I spent two years at college studying a level three extended diploma in engineering. Uh, when I came out of college I kind of struggled to find any apprenticeships or meaningful work that I wanted to do that, that interested me uh, and that made me want to go to work. Um, eventually this started to get me down. Um, I, I took a job uh, delivering pizzas um, just to fund myself in the short term and I just kept looking around for opportunities but I didn't find much coming up. So I'm a young carer for my mum and my sister. Uh, they're both uh, disabled and uh, got various health issues, which has meant that I've had to spend quite a lot of time at home looking after them with uh, my other family members. Um, this I meant this meant sorry that I was in touch with the Young Carers Centre for Blackpool, who uh, advised me of an upcoming movement to work event with the Prince's Trust and BAE Systems. This was a four-week program which had a taste today uh, which allowed them to see yourself and also for, for myself to uh, get familiar with everybody and to see if I was a fit for the program. Once the day had ended uh, I found out that I was successful um, and I found out quite late so it was only the next week that the course started so off I went to Preston North End Football Club where they um, that's where they hosted us in a really nice events room. Uh, we did all sorts in the first week. It was a, around based around transferable skills um, and some things like team building, um, developing your knowledge about different businesses, um, how to act in a workplace, and various other transferable skills, which I definitely note down to um, have a look at yourselves in the future. Um, these transferable skills that the program taught me, they allowed me to apply these to any job. So if I wasn't successful with BAE Systems, I was able to take this off and use them in any job that I might come across. Um, an example of that is um, they, we, we talked about timekeeping and, and all kinds of things like that. And if it's engineering or it's medicine or it's beauty or it's any, any different industry, that is a transferable skill that I could take somewhere else. So the Prince's Trust, the Movement to Work and BA Systems have really put together a, a strong programme um, that doesn't just think about themselves, it thinks about the individual that's undertaking the programme and what would benefit them most. Moving on into the second two weeks, I completed work experience. Um, at first, I was... Um, a bit disheartened because we didn't get to choose the placements and I felt like where I was going was not going to suit me and what I wanted to do but I quickly realised that it's not about where you are um, and uh, and what the job role is. The BA Systems and Movement to Work and the Prince's Trust have really created a, a well-structured and full um, programme throughout the two weeks and it gave me lots to go off. Um, for when I was applying for jobs, um, I, I then had experience in the workplace and I had all sorts to go uh, to take away from the program. In the fourth week, we did uh, it was a lot based around your CV. Um, some people I had a CV, so I was fortunate enough to have help, but there were some people there who don't didn't have support outside of the program. And this gave them an opportunity, which was vital, to either create a CV or build on their existing CV, which I felt was very helpful, even to myself, who already has one. Um, throughout the course, I really enjoyed it. There was I had mentors to help me throughout anything that was, um, even down to providing help trying to get to and from the workplace. Um, they were willing to help with that, so... It just shows how far they go to help you within the programme. Just as a, a sort of a, an, an ending note, just some advice for the young people uh, that I would give is that perseverance is key. Don't think about money. 
Focus on building your skills and the money will come later. Look for opportunities, even if it doesn't pay you, such as volunteering, work experience, programs like this one that I've undertaken, and you can't expect things to come to you. You need to go out and get it and make your own luck and your own opportunities. Thank you for listening.